Córchula es conocida por una controversia entre los venecianos y los croatas. ¿Por qué? Por un viajero que fue muy muy famoso, que se fue hasta China, incluso también es conocido por la ruta de la, de la seda. Si estáis pensando en Marco Polo, entonces estáis en lo correcto. Marco Polo dicen que fue nacido en Venecia por los venecianos y fue nacido en Córchula por los croatas, así que hoy lo descubriremos, pero realmente llevamos muy poco tiempo por aquí paseando por las calles y ya estamos viendo un montón de museos, de tiendas relacionadas con Marco Polo, con souvenirs, todo está relacionado con Marco Polo, así que vamos a ver realmente qué nos ofrece esta isla. Pero antes de empezar, no os olvidéis de suscribiros y dar me gusta al vídeo. We just climbed St. Marco's Tower and you have some beautiful views all from the city. I mean, absolutely beautiful views over the city. Uh, 360 degree panoramic views. The only thing is when you come up, take your time, trust me, because the hike is definitely worth it. And when you visit, you'll see what I mean. It's some of the most dangerous stairs I've ever seen in my life. So you really have to be careful when you climb. But it's absolutely breathtaking views from up here. Supposedly Marco Polo's house here in Cortula and it costs like 20 euros. Oh, no, sorry 20 kunas to enter and Basically for me is is a tourist trap. The only thing that you have is you can climb the tower and have Not even the same views that you had from the church, which is literally less than 100 meters away from you So I wouldn't really recommend coming here unless you want some a different perspective of the bay and of the area That's pretty much it, but literally, they give you a postcard and nothing else. We got love that we'll never need to hide. Love will always rise above. Whatever comes, we will be just fine. If I am yours and you are mine. Take my hand and let's fly away. So guys, we just went into the museum and it's what, about 60 kunas per person for adults and then for students they have a little bit of a discount. You go into like five or six different rooms and they give you an audio guide as well. And I have to admit, they give you the whole story. So supposedly, like they said, he was born here. We don't know for sure. There's a lot of debate and argument about that. But the rest of the story, they show the entire history of his of his history, of his travels, of everything to Asia, and they talk about everything, including the origin of spaghetti and how it came from Asia, and apparently Marco Polo brought it, as well as gelato or ice cream as well, and they did an excellent job, really, really, really good job. It's definitely worth going to the museum. Niles, not so much. Just be with me, just be Acabamos 
de comer en uno de los restaurantes del paseo de aquí de Córchula. Es precioso porque tenemos unas vistas sobre el mar increíbles. Los precios están, son estándares, realmente no es que sea muy caro, tampoco es muy barato, es decir, estándar. Pero hemos tomado una pizza y creo que ha costado unos 10 euros y yo me he tomado un tagliatele al pesto, también 9 euros, por lo cual pues más o menos son precios estándares. Está muy bien el precio, el, el restaurante lo, lo recomendamos realmente y Córchula nos está gustando mucho realmente, sobre todo la parte más medieval, la parte del centro histórico, porque puedes ver pues toda la fortificación y es muy interesante, tienes unas vistas estupendas sobre el mar y es muy mediterráneo realmente, se siente súper súper bien. So guys, we came to the only sandy beach on the island of Fortula. It's not that far from the town. It's a good idea though if you want to take either rent a bike, which you can do in the city easily, or you can take a taxi, but that can be a little expensive. But it's a beautiful place to come, great place to relax, and it's very, very flat. You can actually walk out about 100 meters and still be about waist high. So it's a great place if you want to play some water sports or anything. Let me say goodbye every time you say goodnight. I'm gonna steal you away forever Oh, we can go across the oceans and see the world tonight Oh, say hello to the mountains and watch the new sunrise But no matter what the country, the city, the street Today is our last day guys here in Korchula, so I'm gonna end the video now because tomorrow we have to get up early to go to Dubrovnik. We really like this town, but this is definitely the opposite of Havar. If you want a party town, go to Havar. If you want to relax and maybe enjoy a bit of the scenery or enjoy a bit of the history, come here and especially if you like Marco Polo, they have a lot of history here as well. So thank you for watching guys, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, like the video down below, check the rest of my travel videos out and my cooking videos as well and I'll see you guys again bright and early tomorrow in Dubrovnik and our last day and time in Croatia. Take care. To another galaxy Only close I want to feel your love Together we are free Just be with me Just be with me Just be with me